Earlier this year, the world was blown away by amazing skateboarding athletes like Sky Brown. I wanted to find out more about how skateboarding's Olympic debut would affect the sport as we know it. I started by speaking with Jeff Boardman from Clown Skateboards, a company that supports skateboarding communities around the country. So I joined up with a friend um, who was very lucky at that point, another really good friend uh, was Banksy. So he, we was work, I was working with him on a number of projects at that point um, and painting with him, etc. And then he done our logo and 2000, we set the company up. For the kids, skateboarding was still pretty new and um, people didn't really know what to make of it. So they just assumed it was a bad thing and it was, wasn't portrayed that great on TV a lot of the time because uh, it's got as far as the Olympics where um, you know people are seeing it as a sport and there's money attached and there's um, you know fashions attached commitment people can see it you know and came across really well on the Olympics on TV so hopefully we're um, going in the right direction that's for sure. Yeah, I think it's been a really good impact for the girl skaters around here. Um, the shop we've sold all of uh, the girl completes within like the first week of skating. Um, so yeah, definitely a positive impact for us. It's good to see lots of girls coming down, not just like a guy dominated thing now. Like I can already like people are taking it a lot more seriously, like especially the older community. And what I've found and what I've already started to see is that something that becomes hot and it is becoming it's it's a hot ticket. It's probably getting a lot more coverage than, I don't know, archery. Let's put it that way. Um, so it's a bit of a hot ticket at the moment, is that there's outside influences that always like to be involved with things hot. Do you know what I mean? So you've got, and, suppose, and also people look at it and go, right, okay, this is worth X amount of money on my spreadsheet. So straight away, you've got people like, I don't know, Sports, Jay-Z Sports Direct, some of the other high streets, right? Selling boards. Mm. You've got brands like Fila and people like that making skate equipment. I just, I'm just worried about the outside influences trying to take a large chunk of what the community needs and what mm. the industry needs to keep going the way that they're going. It's um, so everybody who goes and buys a complete from I don't know JD Sports means that they're not buying a, a complete from the local independent. Um, also, the people who are at the Olympics, would they have been at the Olympics if they didn't have their first ever shop sponsor? Because all these people that made it there now, even though they might be riding for, I don't know, Nike, people like that, they first got the enthusiasm and they first got the love and they first got the support probably by getting free grip tape bearings and some wheels from their local shop mm. so that gave them the enthusiasm to carry on and if you if big industry as such comes in and takes over it you're going to knock out that layer so where and that layer would not the people in the olympics would not be there because of mm -hmm. that earlier last week i caught up with Maisie at south bank and i asked her what she thought about having someone like sky brown on her TV. Um, it's really inspiring to like kids like, like, and young women. Um, it doesn't see any boundaries at all, do you know what I mean? And it's very supportive. It's probably one of the only things or one of the only communities I know would actually, do you know what? They you would cheer for the good guy, but you'd cheer for the little guy as well at the same level. You know what I mean? It's uh, there is there's that re respect and love for anybody who tries to achieve something. I think this is the start of something bigger. I do think that obviously skateboard's been around for years, but um, we're seeing a massive change in how many people are taking part in it, but also how passionate they are about it. Um, so I don't see that going away.